August has earned the label as one of the worst performing months for stocks of the year. But will that be the case this year? For the past 35 years, August has been the U.S. stock market's worst month on average, worse even than September. The Dow's average August return since 1986 is minus 0.67% and versus an average gain of 1.05% for the other months of the year. Since 1945, the S&P 500 posted its third worst average monthly return and third most volatile performance in August. Even after the hot start to the month, the odds are against August during economic recessions, which may be the case this year. On the flip side, the Nasdaq is now technically out of its bear market and in a bull market, while the Dow ended a market correction. Bank of America said its institutional clients poured more money into tech and communication stocks last week than ever before. So what's in store? With volatility hitting its lowest level since April, I would expect higher volatility ahead for the remainder of the month, given the macroeconomic and geopolitical overhang that we are experiencing.